Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with Jaspie's 20 box hit stick football. I'm not entirely sure I know what a hit stick is. Football mixer. We're giving away $1,000 of break credit as well. So at the end, if you're in the break, we're just taking all 32 names. You don't have to even do anything. Just get into the break. Randomize your names, top four, $250 of break credit each. We'll do that at the very end of the break along with any other randomizers that we got to do. Here's all the boxes involved in the break. A lot of different years right here. There you go. There's a visual look at it. Pretty good stuff. Big thanks to everybody here. Thanks to these four right here for digging deep, knocking out the final straight up spot. Hey, I appreciate anybody who bought a spot straight up, took the risk that way. I also appreciate the people who got into the fillers too. That's a big risk, fillers. But congrats again to the winners. All 32 teams are in. Let's do it. Let's roll it. Let's randomize names and teams. Four and a five, nine times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. Four and a five, nine. And so after nine times, we got Alex. Down to Joe. Four and a five, nine times. For the teams, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. After nine, Colts down to the Bills. Uh, Gilo's jealous of you dual income people. I guarantee you that that the that the <laughs> wow Lakers barely got out of that game. I guarantee you, Gilo, even the dual income people, the uh, their partners are not letting them spend this much money on group breaks. Alex, it's, so it's it's their own income. Alex with the Colts, yeah. Jared's a single dad too. Alex with the Colts, Joe with the Rams, Logan M with the Giants and the Bears. Monty with the Cowboys, Gail with the Bengals, Allen with the Falcons, Joe with the Steelers, Jason with the Chargers, Kyle with the Eagles, Sean with the Jets, Jesse, you got my Raiders. Joshua with the Buccaneers, Jared with the Cardinals, Evan with the Dolphins, Asa with the Lions, Joshua with the Panthers, Andrew with the Broncos, Joe with the Niners, JC with the Chiefs, Brett, last spot, Mojo, Seattle Seahawks. Ryan with the Texans, Bennett with the Patriots, Asa with the Ravens, Ryan with the Washington football team, Kevin. With the Browns, Martin with the Saints, Mike with the Packers, Joe with the Titans, Michael with the Vikings, Mark with the Jaguars, and Joe with the Buffalo Bills. Let's get all this on one page. Let's sort by column B, alphabetically by team. Let's box this up. I'm going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades, um, and then we'll have the break. And I'm going to set up all the boxes right here, too, in the meantime. Um, we'll be right back. All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Um, little, a lot of trade chatter, but in the end, no deals were done. I did a count. There, we got all 19 box here. I just need to make a little room for myself here. So no trades, so that list remains the same. Thanks, everybody, for digging deep tonight and knocking out this 20-box uh, hit stick football mixer. Thank you, everybody. Congrats again to the people who won spots. Big thanks to the people who bought spots straight up. Appreciate it. All right, so there are 19 boxes here. It's going to be a lot of fun. Let's get that Michael Bay helicopter shot going there. So we're just going to just grab random boxes, just whatever's in front of me. Maybe I'll try to get some of the base heavier stuff out of the way first, like this. And then we'll just keep, keep on keeping on from there. Good luck, everybody. So we're going to start off with 2020 Mosaic. We've... We actually did all these packs, a lot of these packs for the filler for this break. So these are these are where those packs come from inside these white boxes. All right, good luck everybody, and and we'll close out with the uh, with the jerseys at the end. 
Now, for I'll, I'll remind everybody about this later, but when we get to the college edition jersey, remember, we're going to go by our no checklist rules. So whatever the jersey is, if it's an active player, it'll go to the team they're currently on. And if they're retired, it'll go to the team they played for the longest. Yeah, I do love a, I do love a good action film. I think Michael Bay did The Rock, if I'm not mistaken. Did you know that a lot of the, there's a fan theory going around that The Rock is actually a unofficial Sean Connery James Bond movie? So there's like people on Reddit and on YouTube who have taken this theory and really di took a deep dive into it, looking back at the Sean Connery canon Sean Connery Bond movies. And they just they kind of figure out timelines of all the stuff that he says. Think about it. He says he's a British Secret Service agent in the movie. So it's just the James Bond, Sean Connery James Bond timeline. That was good timing there, you guys. Tristan, what's going on? There you go. Congrats to your Braves. Well, we're done for tonight, Tristan. You're going to have to save your breaking enthusiasm for tomorrow. Yeah, we just filled up this 20-box this football mixer. So this is going to take us a little bit past the end of our night. Yeah, congrats. I mean, you had to beat my Dodgers to get there, but I was like, boy, if the Dodgers are going to lose to this team, they better win the World Series. And they did. Congrats. I do have a number of, uh, a number of friends from Georgia. So I think, I think they, were, they, were super ha they were super happy. No, it's all good, man. Enjoy yourself. Enjoy. Just be careful, but just enjoy yourself. But yeah, I mean, you know, the Braves fans that I know are really, really good dudes, and and uh, and dudettes. There's there's a girl in that group too, and um, so they're they're big fans, all happy. I mean, it's been a while. It's been a long time. So I'm I'm happy. I mean I mean, Jock Peterson's on that team. You know I like Jock Peterson. Ever I mean everyone seems to love Freddie Freeman, right? I think he's kind of universally liked in baseball. So I think a lot of people were rooting for him. So I mean Max Freed, who is excellent on the mound today. He's a Southern California guy. He's an L A guy. And so I think a lot of a lot of people in this area were um, a lot of people in this area were rooting for for Max Fried to have a good start, and he did. So I'm sure there's there's other connections too, but I think a lot of people were, were pretty happy. And like you know, Brian Snicker was in uh, he was in the Braves organization for God knows how long. GM Alex Anthopoulos spent a few years in, in LA here with the Dodgers. So he was always well respected as, a, as an excellent as an excellent GM or baseball executive here, but went on to be a great GM, made a lot of great moves in the summer to, to make up for Ronald Acuna Jr. So I mean, it all fell into place. So congrats. All right, so Mosaic Football. Right, that's right. I keep forgetting that Freddie Freeman's from around here, too, from Southern California. There's Joe Burrow, NFL debut, base. There's a silver A.J. Dillon, and Packers, you'll also get this green Jordan Love. I think in the interest of time, we're 
quarterbacks are going to get the uh, get that extra attention really quick. Um, Bengals, that's going to be for Gale, and Green Bay, that is going to be for Mike. All right, next. Yeah, no, no, no. Hey, you're excited. Hey, celebrate, man. We're 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 here to celebrate with you. I mean, I guess Astros fans aren't going to celebrate with you, but I, I think I think a lot of uh, a lot of neutrals are rooting for the Braves. So, congrats, yeah. Snickers, a brave, a brave lifer. I mean, there's just a lot of, a lot of great things. Yeah, as for Gronk, man. Yeah, Tristan was saying Jock Peterson is like our, our, our Gronk, just really kind of added that different energy to that team. I feel like an energy the Dodgers could have used in the playoffs. But yeah, Joe Loke is saying he got Gronk parties. And still, still is able to go out there and play professional football. It's like I don't know. It's, there were there were people like that in college. I knew some guys and some girls in college who would just like rage until the wee hours of the morning, you know, and then like just crush a midterm. Some people can just do that. I'm assuming Vet Commons don't ship in this mixer. No, all cards ship. Wow. That's even better. Well, you'll be getting these Tom Brady's. I was going to set some aside, but the Tom Brady's on the list of Vet Commons that do ship. But since everything ships, I don't have to worry about that. You're going to get all that stuff. And there's Jalen Hurts. Quarterbacking the Eagles, Kyle with the fly, Eagles fly. <laughs> Tristan lived in Tucson when Gronk went to U of A. Tristan must have stories. There's an NFL debut, pink camo, Justin Herbert. Chargers, that's going to go to Jason. That's so, what a what a sad story. They're very disappointing as a Raiders fan. All right, next box. Should we get that? Let's get that college box out of the way. The draft picks, right here. Our, we're gonna have our shipping team, our sorting and shipping team, make sure all these cards go to the right place. All right, and our autograph is Christian Darsha. We got a Joseph uh, Osai, Red Wave. Philip Rivers to 199. Um, that'll go to whatever's on the whatever he is on the checklist, probably the Chargers. There's Cade Johnson, draft picks autograph. Another huge party, Luke Walton, huh? I guess that doesn't really surprise me. <laughs> There's Carson Wentz at 249. You know, uh, Luke Walton has popped into this shop a few times in the offseason. There's Kadarius Tony, 15 out of 75. Uh, that's for the New York Football Giants. That's going to go to Logan M. Banged up a little bit, but 
pretty good player when healthy. Cam Akers to 149. Carson Wentz. And we've got Caden Stearns. Blue Ice. Auto. Seven out of seventy-five. Micah Parsons, Amonra St. Brown to two ninety-nine, and we've got a Ombre Thomas, Purple Ice Auto. That is out of ninety-nine. Baker Mayfield to ninety-nine. Greg Rousseau for the Bills to 199. Like I said, I'm going to set those college cards off to the side because they'll be sorted out and looked up differently. All right, let's go to this, I guess, Donruss Hybrid. Maybe this break isn't going to take as long as I thought. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Luke Walton's still coaching the Kings, Mark. I feel like we would have heard if he was, if he was let go. But yeah, him and his uh, his kids, I think, have have come in. He's got he's got little kids. I think they've come in a few times to buy like Pokemon cards for the kids. And he, nice job. I don't think I've I've not personally said hi to him, but but yeah, it just seems like a really nice guy. So Donner's hybrid, what do we got here? We got Legereus Sneed, Aaron Donnell, Hayden Hurst, Travis Kelsey, Kyler Murray, it's a rated rookie Mac Jones for the Patriots, Bennett with the Pats. Did he try to buy a PSA 10 RPA, Luke? Well, no. There was uh, there was none available. They were, we, we told them they sell out too quickly every time they're available. I think he had, I want to say he had, he had boxes of cards that he wanted to either try to sell to us or just kind of see what they were worth. And I think they were like, there were boxes from Kobe's rookie year, I think, or is it LeBron's rookie year, something like that. He, has, he had some nice boxes that he was he had hanging around. Gilo, do you think there's an extra? He's asking, do you think there's an extra advantage for teams getting extra rest from playing Thursday night games? Chiefs play finished Monday night and play Green Bay next week after they play Thursday night. I don't know. I don't know if any of the players are terribly thrilled with Thursday night games at all. I think it really just jams everybody up. Kyle Pitts. I think generally, I'm not sure about the games afterwards, but I feel like, I feel like the games, you know, they usually, they usually they say, um, he's been actually running the ball pretty decently. I want to say that the home teams generally are favored in um, Thursday night football games. Right? Because they don't have to travel on a short week and all that sort of stuff. So I think that does favor them. I'm not sure what the numbers are off the top of my head the weeks after. 
You would think that they do like the extra rest. If you got like Thursday night, if you go from Thursday night all the way to Monday night, I'm sure all those teams welcome the extra rest, but I think Joe Locus, you're lagging behind a few minutes. We pulled that. Uh, we pulled that. Uh, oh, I put it on, on the, in my college saying there's Kadarius Tony autograph out of collegiate. All right, what's next? How about some elite from 2021? Yeah, someone tell Joe that he's lagging behind. He's he's looking at hits that have happened already. Well, let's talk about the schedule this week. New York is uh, at the New York Jets or in Indianapolis. Who does everyone have there? Indy is minus 10 and a half. Is that too many points? That feels like too many points. And the total is only 46 and a half. I kind of like the Jets plus 10 and a half with that low total. Right, double digit points with a total like almost at 45. Hmm. Any, anyone have any thoughts on that Thursday night game? I mean, it's not really the most exciting Thursday night matchup. Got Jared Goff to 399. We got Brevin Jordan to 999. It's for the Texans. We got Christian Barmore to 399 for the Patriots. All right, so nothing too crazy in there. Onwards. Let's stay with that elite mode. Uh, what year is this? This is 2020 elite. into that how, how about a how about a divisional matchup here Browns at Bengals Browns at Bengals another low total game 46 and a half Bengals are favored home favorites minus two and a half Got Joshua Kelly to three ninety nine. Got a Tyreek Hill playmakers. Michael Pittman Jr. to forty nine. Logan saying Browns with those with that OBJ issues. It's Philip Lindsay to three ninety nine. Chad says Bengals crush him. Yeah, I think I'm leaning. I think I'm slightly leaning Bengals here. I'll have my official picks, but just kind of absorbing what we're what's going on there. Yeah, Gilo's still weird at the Browns are, are pretty good. Yeah, they're four and four, but yeah, I mean, I think they dropped a game or two just because of some Baker Mayfield's been banged up a little bit. His non-throwing shoulder messed up a little bit. Someone was saying earlier in the chat that, that there was a rumor that the Raiders were close to making a deadline deal for, uh, for Odell Beckham Jr. All right, some rookies and stars. What year is this? This is 2017 rookies and stars. So uh, let's keep an eye out for... Mahomes, Patrick Mahomes. We didn't pass by Patrick Mahomes, did we? And that was Alex Smith. 
it's Trevor Simi who might be starting for the. All right, let's look for your 2017 rookies. There's Matt Collins. Vince, Thursday's easy money. Where are you leaning? Yeah, the football deadline never seems to be as exciting. Trade deadline never seems to be as exciting as uh, as like the baseball trading deadline. All right, no, no, twenty seventeen there. Toss that kid reporter card. No, all good, Joe. All good. Take care, take care of the fam first. All right, elements, 2021 elements. Mark, you'd, you'd lay the minus 10 and a half with the Colts with that low total? Yeah, maybe you're right. Maybe I'm trying to outsmart myself. All right, let's see what we got here. We have Tom Brady. 81 out of 94. Yeah, I, I mean, I think I get that feeling too. I feel like Vegas wants me to take. It's like, Joe, don't you love that double-digit point spread with the Jets and that low total? There's Russell Wilson, 12 out of 250. And I'm just like, yeah, I kind of do like that. There's Davis Mills to 199. Husky Dolphin is saying that game opened at like 14 to 14 and a half and went down to 10 and a half. Hmm. There's Davis Mills, Relic for Houston. That's for Ryan Hines. And there's Terrence Marshall Jr., gold ink autograph over that Relic. That looks pretty cool. 40 out of 49. Rookie Neon Sigs for Carolina. Joshua. I mean, it's, maybe it's a lot of public money going, public play. Jack Youngblood, old school Ram, on plate autograph. It's pretty cool. Every once in a while, around town, around town, you'll see, uh, especially on game days, you'll see people wearing old Rams Jack Youngblood jerseys. That's Joe Locus with the Rams. All right, where are we here? Maybe some select. Yeah, the public is taking the Jets. A lot, lot of public money who just saw the Jets, you know, throw, throw a bunch. And now the public is like, oh, what we saw last was the Jets being incredible, beating the Bengals. But now it's a short week and they're traveling to Indianapolis, so. And I'd pass, but I'm trying to do a little, like, project where I'm, like, picking all the those island games. So, I don't know. Let's see if I'm smart or not on Thursday. Join me on Thursday for Thursday Night Football. And see what Joe's pick is. I know, Vince. I should have listened to you. There's Khalil Mack. Die cut. Aaron Rodgers die cut. There's Jalen Hurts. And a Justin Herbert. Justin Tucker and Troy Aikman. But I, I got I to gotta pave my own way, Vince. Win or lose. All right, Jalen Hurts. I think that's field level, Kyle. Yeah, it is. Nice. The shorter print of all those base cards. And the Justin Herbert is concourse level. Chargers, Jason. All right. What about uh, some optic hybrid? Got 
What about Broncos at Cowboys? Is that inside? Does that move the needle for anybody? Broncos at Cowboys. Cowboys are minus nine and a half. I don't know if I like that game. Texans at Dolphins. Who's watching that game? Someone's gonna have to win that game, right? Two one and seven teams. Another divisional Fal Falcons at Saints. Saints are minus six, with probably Trevor Simeon as their quarterback mostly. Broncos are pretenders. I don't think, did anyone actually think they were contenders? Although I do have Bridgewater on my fantasy team. Two QB league. Um, oh, hey, what about my Raiders? Raiders on the road, road favorites. Minus two and a half in New York, New York Giants. And there's Cole Komet, rated rookie autograph for the Bears. That goes to Logan M. Jaguars, Josh Allen to 299. Jordan Love, the rookies. Mark's pretty bummed about that Von Miller trade. Von Miller looked like he was pretty bummed too. I would take Raiders plus two and a half right now, Mark, but they are minus two and a half. It's Justin Herbert, Elite Series. Jalen Hurts, Red Mojo, not numbered, but still nice. Kyle with the Eagles. No, oh, you mean minus two. You like the minus two and a half. I kind of do too, actually. All right, let's go Origins, I guess. I guess this break's going a little bit faster than I thought. We're about 30 minutes in. I think we got about another 30 minutes to go. an Origins Blaster box. I don't think I've seen it. Origins Blaster yet. I guess we're kind of looking for these. Yeah, that's what it seems like. I think a lot, a lot of people who just saw saw the Daniel Jones go toe to toe. For some reason, they've got a weird record where they're great against the spread on the road as dogs. For some reason, they play well on the road. They're competitive on the road, and they go home and I don't know something just doesn't go right there. Yeah, the card stock's the same as Origins. It's Devonta Smith to one seventy five. Najee Harris. That might be a Variation. Joe Montana. Najee Harris. Sam Ellinger to 299. And a Devonta Smith variation, looks like. Patrick Mahomes, Big Bang? Is that one of the... That's an ultra-rare Big Bang insert, allegedly. I haven't done a lot of these boxes, so I don't know how rare they are, but I'll, I'll, I'll give Panini the benefit of the doubt. Chiefs, JC with Kansas City. It's like has a little uh, some black foil right around the lettering too. That looks pretty cool. 
Nice. All right, maybe some playbook. I got a 48 out of 49. Mark Ingram back with the Saints. We've got two purple teams here. First purple player is Chris Moore for the Ravens. Three out of 50 for Asa in Baltimore. And the book is Moritz Boringer. Two color, dual relic, and autograph. 16 out of 49. Some of you may remember that he was the first German-born player to be drafted in the NFL. Vikings, Michael Hughes. I don't know if he lasted very long, but for what it's worth, that's what I... Should we just do passing the torch? Sure, three autos in here? Might as well, it's right in front of me. 2019. I think these are actually pretty nice autographs, I want to say. Whoa, one of one. Torchbearer signature is Dan Marino. Woo! The man. Evan with the Dolphins. One of one, Dan Marino. Out of fives and under, get the train whistle. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! We got torch marks. Mark Gasnow for the New York Jets, Jets, Jets. It'll be for Sean Maddock. On Mark saying that the Big Bang Mahomes sold for 200 bucks. That's pretty nice. Points. Disappointing. We'll randomize this to one person in the break. Winner take all. And then we've got Jerry Rice to 60. And a 3 out of 5 Stephon Diggs Vikings edition. Can you dig it? Michael Hughes with the Minnesota Vikings. All aboard. Woo woo. All right, that was pretty nice. Let's get some 2021 certified going. All right, good luck, gang. We're almost at the end. Here's what I'm gonna do with those points. We're giving away that break credit. I think it's only top four who wins break credit. So the fifth name down will get any and all points if there happens to be more as, you know, consolation prize. So we save ourselves doing a bunch of randomizers. Derrick Henry. We got a Saquon Barkley to two ninety nine. There's Derek Carr. Devontae Parker to one ninety nine. Justin Herbert, second year, and there's Kyle Trask. Nice patch, nice auto to one forty nine for the Buccaneers. Joshua with the Bucks. I've heard some people say they really like Kyle Trask just kind of marinating behind. There's Trevor Lawrence marinating behind uh, Tom Brady for a season or two or however long Tom Brady wants to play. Simi Feoko, 129 out of 199. That'll be for Dallas. That's going to go to Monty. And there's also that 2021 Trevor Lawrence. I like that street art look in the background there from Certified. That'll be for Mark and the Jags. There's Jalen Darden, new generation rally, 203 out of 249. Another Buccaneer going to Joshua. 
And we've got a Josh Rosen mirror signatures. Niners edition. Is he still on the Niners? 131 out of 135. After Trey Lance, they, they they must have moved moved him moved him somewhere else. Michael Carter, two forty nine. We got Racy McMath to ninety nine. Javante Williams to three ninety nine. Tom Brady stars insert. Jalen Hurts and Joe Burrow. And some kid reporter cards. All right, let's do some gold standard. Really like this gold standard. Is that a relic on the bottom? Yeah, oh, relic auto on the bottom. All right, here we go. Right off the top, we got a Tannehill to 99, Tennessee, and Javon Holland to 75 for Miami. Let's see how Tannehill does. What do you think? Is our, it's, it's a Sunday night game. Titans at Rams. Rams are minus 7.5. Total, game total is 53.5. How do the Titans do without Derrick Henry? We got Adrian Peterson, though. 13 out of 199 because I feel like the just the ability to have Derrick Henry changes a lot of things. That's for Seattle. That'll go to Brett. Jeremy Shockey, gold standard relic, 299. Mark, Mark Delaris says take the Rams. Yeah, I'm thinking Rams too on that Sunday nighter. Are we getting it now, Mark? At minus seven and a half before it goes to minus eight and a half. Uh, that Jeremy Shockey is Giants edition going to Logan M. And here is Drew Locke, white gold relic, 141 to 299. Denver, that's going to go to Andrew B. Patrick Sertain the second, another Bronco to 25. Yeah, Gilo misses the old bruiser backs. Yeah, the, the old bruising backs, bell cow type backs. It's not, not really in vogue these days. It may come back. I mean, sports, like life, things tend to run in cycles, you know. It might come back. But right now, it's just, it just just doesn't happen too often. And Callan Mond is your triple relic and gold ink autograph. 38 out of 49 for the Vikings. Michael Hughes. All right, let's, uh, we've got some, some of these boxes remaining here. Why don't we do the blaster box first, Prism Blaster. Jalen Hurts, Prism Rookie, and the Grant Del Pitt. Yeah, I think you're right, Mark, on the uh, on the uh, on the that Titans Rams game. Another Jalen Hurts for the Eagles. I think this is Prism. This must be Prism Team All. I want to say. Let's look at the check the break list here. Yeah, I think that's Prism Team All.
Yeah, someone was saying, I mean, I, I know this is like, you know, pretty common knowledge, but it's worth like remembering just how, how much you need a running game. It like, seems so obvious to say, but how much you need a running game, especially in the red zone. You know, like when, you, when you're in the red zone, obviously, like you don't have time for like these complicated routes to kind of like develop. You know, sometimes you just need to just need the ability to run the ball and get get it into the, you know, and get get it into the end zone. There's Josh Reynolds to forty nine. So I mean, so Derrick Henry, a guy like Derrick Henry, you know, it's actually it's dude twenty twenty first. So losing a guy like Derrick Henry, I mean. To state the obvious, you know, it's just really going to change the way that Titans offense looks and how it can operate when they're in that, in the red zone. Ooh, nice. Joe Burrow, Mosaic Silver for Cincinnati. Gale with the Bengals. And there's Gabriel Davis, Fusion Red. That is for the Bills. Buffalo! <laughs> right, Gilo. That's the Chiefs' biggest problem, right? Gilo's a Chiefs fan. Gabe's saying, like, listen, you're, our guys can't go deep into the red zone, right? If you're in the red zone, you can't really go deep. You know, that's the kind of like you almost neutralize Tyreek Hill that way. That'll be for Joe Locus and the Bills. There's Mad Max Crosby, love this guy, to, to 80. Got Kirk Cousins to 80. And there's a Peacock. Nice. I think this is a pretty short printed card. I think in Mosaic. This goes to Jared with the Cardinals. Gets the Christian Kirk Peacock short print. We got Ezekiel. We got Joshua Kelly, Brandon Ayuk. And Zeke. All right, now, 2021. Is this Choice Edition or is this Mosaic? What Mosaic? Oh, this is Mosaic Draft? I should have done this a little bit earlier. I want to get all the college stuff out of the way first. All right, now remember, this has this mosaic has a checklist, probably on groupratechecklist.com, has a checklist, so they'll go to the teams that they are uh, currently on. I don't think any of these rookies have been traded anyway. But that, which is college edition, right? Actually, I can raise my camera now. So that says college edition right there. Remember, that has doesn't have a checklist, so we're going by our non-pro uniform rules. If they're in the college uniform, it'll go to the team they're currently on if they're active and um, to the team they played for the longest if they're retired, according to, um, according to profootballreference.com. We got a Javante Williams. I think he's, he's a Bronco, maybe? But our, our sorting and shipping team will make sure they, this all goes to the right place. The Trey Lance goes to the Niners, of course, and Larry Roundtree, the third. There's a Dak Prescott in his Mississippi State gear to forty nine. Sean Wade to 75 and Killen Hill to 99. I'm going to set this in a different pile for the college group. All right, jersey time. Put your thinking caps on. We'll do a quick two round. Who am I? America's favorite game. Where I give you the clues, and you try to guess who this is. 
I'm gonna actually turn off that top camera because sometimes you can see the see the jersey from there. All right. Who are you? Uh huh. Uh huh. All right. Okay. This guy right now falls into the category of. If only he was healthy, he's a running back. If only he was healthy, what a career I could have. He's an active player, a running back in the NFL, only 24 years old. First round pick, was the second overall pick, was the offensive rookie of the year, a pro bowler his rookie year, has a total of 2,539 rushing yards, 19 rushing touchdowns. I already have 163 catches. 1,300 yards, receiving seven rushing touchdowns. Yep, Saquon Barkley. I made it easy. Saquon Barkley, and this is college, so it's in his, yeah, Mark's got it, Chad's got it, Joe's got it, Logan's got it. It's in his college gear. Obviously, he's only played for one team his entire career, so it's in his Penn State colors. There's the autograph right there. There's the JSA, the corresponding JSA card. It's just a custom jersey, so there's nothing, no official licensing on here, but it looks like they've got some, I, I kind of love when they do this. They kind of put all like some stats on, on his jersey and whatnot. So pretty cool. So that goes to Logan M and the Giants with the spot he bought straight up. Thanks, Logan. Logan again. All right. There it is. Congrats. All right. And the final jersey before we randomize before we randomize a bunch of money, is a Gold Rush football jersey edition, Series 7. Hey, thanks everybody for digging deep and knocking out this break, either via filler or with the spots straight up. I appreciate it. If your break has not been kind to you, and I know a lot of people have not called a lot of people's numbers in this break, I realize that, but we are giving away that break credit, so fingers crossed. All right, and the final jersey... Hmm. I am retired, a retired quarterback. Retired quarterback who got into the Hall of Fame in 2017. Who am I? Super Bowl champion, Super Bowl MVP, two-time NFL Most Valuable Player, a Walter Payton uh, NFL Man of the Year award winner. Um, had 208 touchdowns in my career to my 128 interceptions, 32,344 passing yards, and then with a passer rating of 93.7. Played for one, two, three NFL teams my entire career. But I was an undrafted quarterback. Yep. Kevin, you got it. What gave it away? Oh, maybe the Hall of Fame year gave it away? But yeah, went to college at Northern Iowa. Went undrafted in 1994. Was with the Packers, I think, practice squad his first year. Then went to the Iowa Barnstormers for a couple of years. The Amsterdam Admirals in 1998. I think was maybe uh, bagging groceries at some point. And then got to the St. Louis Rams in 1998. Things... Uh, looked looked up from there. I think that I think they've been working on doing like a movie of his his life or something like that. Nice. So that's obviously Rams colors. That goes to Joe Locus, who won a spot via the filler. Got randomized to the Rams. I don't think I called your number out very often in this break. And now, you're rewarded with a 
Kurt Warner. All right, congrats. All right, now before I do the recap, let's do, well, that's the break, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, first of all. You're welcome, Joe. Let's give away some money, shall we? So let's flip back to the main page right here. It says $1,000 of break credit being given away. At the end of the break, we'll take all 32 customer names, randomize them. Top four, $250 of break credit each. So let's gather everybody's names again. And there's points, remember? So the fifth one will get, fifth person will get the, uh, the consolation prize of 250 points. So there's everybody's names. Thank you and good luck. Let's roll it, randomize it. Four and a two, six times. So once again, top four after six are going to win money. One, two, three, four, five, and sixth and final time. There's six right there, four and a two, there's six. All right, so now five, I mean, consolation prize, Asa, 250 points going your way. But hey, thanks everybody for giving this a shot. I appreciate it. Top four. Really happy times. $250 of break credit to jazbeescasebreaks.com each. Check your emails. Check your spam folders. We'll send it to you after this break. Jesse. I don't think I called your name at all in this break. What teams do you have? Raiders? Nothing. $250 bucks going your way. Thank you. Mike. Did I call your name too often? Packers? I guess there were some Jordan Loves. Nothing. But $250 of break credit going your way. Thank you. Monty? I think I feel like I said Monty's name a couple of times. Maybe nothing too significant, but $250 of break credit going your way. And Brett, Brett, I don't think we saw too many Seahawks for you either, but $250 of break credit going your way. Congrats, everybody. Thanks to everybody else who gave this a shot. Congrats to all the people who got stuff. I appreciate it. Quick little recap right here. Thanks everyone for getting in. A lot of break credit being given away. Got the Mo Wagner. We got that Big Bang super short print. Mahomes it was pretty cool. The Jack Youngblood. Mac Jones, Herberts, Hertz, Loves, Burrows, and of course that one of one. Dan Marino Torchbearer signatures was pretty sweet as well. Thank you very much, everybody. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.